G'day. So, I was mucking about just playing a bit of Snicket, this game that makes no sense. It's all the rage around here, and I hit my ball over there. Don't suppose you feel like feeling it for me, do you? I'd go, only I think it's against the rules. I'm supposed to run up and down on the spot shouting, how's that? Or something. I'll send the rough coordinates to your echo. It's somewhere around there. I'm going to leave you to it while I try and keep track of the score. And believe me, between the two of us, you've got it easy. is too powerful. Keeping that ball out of human hands is the only thing that matters. That's it. The red thing. That's the Snicket ball. Now get it back to me as quick as you can so we can try and win this one. We need 22 off 7.3 with only two Snickets left. We got a chance because they just bowled a ball that wasn't a bowl. And there's no feelers in the circle. Problem is the footholes are really helping the left arm finger spinners out of the rough. This one's really got to go down to the wire. It's not going to be over until the last over, and probably the last bowl of it, too. You did great! I finally got my century, whatever that is, and we either won or lost or drew or tied. Plus, we got three Snicket Maidens back in the pavilion. Oh, mate, I bloody love this game. Just needs a few rule changes so it makes completely and utterly no sense at all, and it'll be ruddy perfect. As a token of my esteem, I'd like to award you with membership of my Snicket Club. <laughs> <laughs> 